Are giant robots the future of underwater mining? A Canadian company called Nautilus Minerals have spent years prepping to mine an area called Solwara 1. Uh, the seabed is of course a massive area, so the mining company have built three massive machines to mine the area. But to put it into perspective, the lightest machine weighs 200 tons. Uh, at this moment in time, these machines live aboard a 700 foot long ship, which is also where these robots will be controlled from. So even the mothership is itself massive. By using cameras, 3D sonar, and very powerful lights, operators will be able to churn up the seabed with ease. So why haven't they hit the waters yet? Well, the company aren't really sure where to put these bad boys. Uh, they've been sending out scout machines to find the perfect drop-off point. Although this isn't something that we would condone, we would rather they just leave the seabed alone, to be honest. Uh, these three machines are pretty impressive. And if they do a clean job, then we would rather that these robots carry out the job rather than something else that could damage the seabed. Uh, even further, really. So, uh, so what do you guys think about these massive robots mining away? Are they just a waste of money? Should we just sort of leave humans uh, sort of off the seabed, leave it all alone? Let's discuss in the comments. If you're watching this on Twitter, then give it a retweet. And to our awesome YouTube family, give it a like, share, and if you haven't already, subscribe to our channel to see more videos like it. Thanks for watching and safe diving.